Hello. Uh, this will be my first time I share a YouTube video trying to share something I found. Um, I have recently bought off Craigslist uh, M Audio Key Studio 49 this keyboard, and I was hoping to use it with some uh, software, of course. I'm a guitarist, but uh, I need a piano every now and then. And when I went to hook it up, I realized that it wasn't working. Uh, the lights came on, and it, the drivers were fine, the windows recognized it. I'm talking on Windows 7 uh, 64, but uh, it wasn't working. Then I started looking around and around and around, and I see some people that said that the pitch bend and the modulation and the volume slide work but the keys itself they were not working uh, I just bought it yesterday and I got a little pissed off that uh, I thought somebody just sold me a lemon and just a broken piece of stuff so I look around uh, M Audio publishes a program that is called MIDI AUX that lets you try uh, certain things to determine whether it's working or not. Um, so I confirmed that the pitch bend, the modulation, and volume slider were working just fine, but yet the keys were completely dead. So I get nothing to lose really. So I simply said, okay, before I throw it away, I'm gonna take it apart, take all the screws. Uh, you have about 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 13, 18 screws, uh, just regular Phillips screws, and took the cover off. So, I'm going to show you what I did. As you can see here, I took the cover off. And much to my surprise, this little connector up here was disconnected so either for motion it doesn't have a click but it, it was simply off I just put it back click it in and then put it back to MIDI aux and all the keys are working so simple fix you don't have to call M Audio or contact uh, technical support just take it apart not too complicated and just before you give up or spend big money on repairs just double check if that connector is properly safe safely connected or not and we'll have a working keyboard again thank you for watching